Howdy partners, we're going to shave with some cacti and maybe even a trip to Tombstone today on Barber Dave's Shaves and Such. everybody welcome to sunday i hope everybody's having a wonderful blessed sunday and uh yeah we're gonna do a shave today quick reminder don't forget that we've got one more week uh for the 1500 subscriber giveaway i make absolutely sure that you enter on the video from last week announcing the contest and make sure not only that you put um uh, that you're in, so just say I'm in, but also put your username over at the Shaving Cadre. And speaking of the Shaving Cadre, if you haven't been there before and you like what you see on the channel and want to get a whole lot more, plus much, much more, come and see us at www.theshavingcadre.com. It's free to join, self-moderated, lots of lots of great things going on over there. And then finally, uh, Drinks and Dave's, Tuesday night, 6 p.m. We're back from our hiatus, and tonight we're going to learn, or tonight, Tuesday night, 6 p.m. Pacific, we're going to learn all about Las Vegas. We have an expert on the ground there, and he's going to tell us all about it. And then, of course, like, subscribe, smash the notification bell, and you'll be uh, notified when new videos come out every two, uh, Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday. Okay, so we said, with the beginning, cacti, and a trip to Tombstone. But quite frankly, I prefer, even though I know it's not correct, I prefer cactuses. It's more fun to say. Say it with me. Cactuses. Now, how many of you did that? So, yes, we are shaving with the plural of cactus, cacti, or in my world, cactuses. God, it's just so fun to say, isn't it? So when I say cactuses, one of those cactuses or cacti is from right out in my yard. So we're going to kind of go out of order here real quick. But this was made by uh, Grey Dog. And this is Choya cactus, the inner part here. And uh, that was stabilized and it's from one of my choya plants. It's called ghost choya because obviously all the stuff that wants to kill you is done with it, but it's just got a really neat um, look to it. Very soft, wasn't sure if it was going to work, but Grey Dog and his magic made it work. The soap today is that tombstone feeling. That's right. The original Ombre's Barbershop. Now, basically, the, the inspiration from this was that I live oh, about an hour, 45 minutes to an hour away from Tombstone. Yes, the real Tombstone. And as a kid, I used to spend a lot of time down there walking the boardwalks. And uh, so it really does smell like the city of Tombstone and actually what you would feel if you walked in to the Tombstone Barbershop in the middle of June, late in the afternoon to get your shave and a haircut and maybe your mustache waxed and then come outside and it's hot and the monsoon rain is uh, going and you get that smell of the rain bush. That's basically what this soap is. The newer iteration that most people are uh, familiar with is Spaghetti Western. And uh, that is more of an homage to uh, Clint Eastwood and the Spaghetti Westerns that were done. Uh, this is a true Southwestern tombstone feeling. I'm working on, I haven't talked to Chris yet, but I'm going to work on uh, another iteration coming up and it's going to be called Doc Holiday. Still thinking about what notes that I want to see on that. So we'll, uh, we'll figure that out. I got to talk to Chris first. Now the razor today is a pulse graph. <laughs> yeah, German. cactus razor. I don't know if you can see that on there, but there's a little saguaro and then the word cactus. So there's our cacti. Although there is one more cacti that we're going to be using just a little bit later on. So 
So again, I want to thank everybody for getting us to 1500. I think we're sitting about 1510 now, so we got a long way to go. 490 to go to the next contest. But we've got a good amount of entries for the contest, but just make sure to be eligible. You got to put your username over at the shaving cadre. So if you haven't joined, you need to do that. And as I said earlier, although my peanut gallery out here didn't hear, I already said it was free. You know, you can't get good production staff. My production assistant keeps thinking about cookie dough ice cream. Although... We've got some really good news and some surprising news from yesterday's date night. But I can't tell you about it. Because actually we just sat at home. This razor is very smooth. It has been stropped uh 30 on oh looks like i caught myself <laughs> didn't even notice uh 30 on linen uh 60 on leather and 25 on a convex a convex bench drop and this is a 5.8 square point, so I think that's probably what I did, is I probably dug in with that point. Doesn't seem too shabby, though. Great first pass, but I can tell you the alum's definitely going to let me know that that's there. Looks like a little slice, actually. I was probably going at the wrong angle. So I'll tell you what I'm going to do, guys. I'm going to play a little bit of Southwestern music for you, and we're going to do our last two passes, and then we'll come back and talk about all the other good stuff. So we'll see you in a little bit, okay? <laughs>
Okay, everybody, we're back. Uh, nice shave. Hope you enjoyed that Western music. That little, uh, I thought it was just a weeper, but it looks like I did catch a, a decent slice. But I mean, it's not really doing much. So we'll let the alum do its work on it. That is the inherent risk of traditional shaving. I've actually cut myself more with a DE than I have with a straight. Go figure. All right, so again, uh, for the razor today, we used, uh, as part of the cacti or cactuses, we used the Cactus 5 8 wonderful razor. For the brush today, we use the Gray Dog Tucson Choya, and this has got a Maggard's high density, super high density uh, badger not in it. For the Witch Hazel today, um, this Witch Hazel has kind of a it's cucumber, but it's got a, uh, a mint component in it, and that's Quinn's cucumber and mint. Uh, and it it does give it does have a kind of a, a blooming mesquite or uh, rainbush, uh, which is kind of a creosote type uh, uh, fragrance to it. So that uh, that works out well. I may have to hit this with the alum again. There we go. Hopefully that will take care of it. Uh, again, uh, for the soap, uh, you know him, you love him. CBL Soaps, Chris Lindsay, Ombre's Barbershop. This is the one that started it all, for me anyway. And for the aftershave today, we are going to be using Ombre's Barbershop from CBO, the Apothecary Tonic, which is like a, it's like a milk, an aftershave milk. Oh, you can really smell the, the terracotta, the, the gunpowder, the, the leather. The leather is the, is the big component. And then of course, the jalapeno flower, and everything else, so it's just wonderful. Now it feels great on the face. Alrighty, let's do some talc. Guess what, Clubman, that's right. So I'll be drawing for the, um, the prize uh, next Sunday, and if you remember, it is a tub of Spaghetti Western. It is the Spaghetti Western um, Aftershave Tonic by CBL. Also, I'm throwing in something from Tucson. I'm not sure quite what yet. But more importantly, it's going to be like coming to my barbershop. So I'm going to be including uh, Roffler Shampoo, uh, Roffler Normalizing Lotion, some Roffler Hairspray. And I'm also going to throw in a a tube of the Roffler Styling Gel, which is a very medium hold. So a lot of you guys wet your hair, put the gel in, you're done. So that's all coming in that prize. So make sure you get in. Okay, the final cactus I'm going to use today is going to be the end of it. And it's by a company called Demeter, or Demeter, however you want to uh, put it. And it is Suaro Cactus. And this is really the bloom of the cactus. I know that Rod over at Sterling just, or, or has a fragrance called... Uh, Saguaro Blossom, and I'm very interested to try that. I haven't purchased it yet. Um, I have his Oro Valley, which is very, very nice, uh, because him and Mandy got married in Oro Valley, Arizona. All right, folks, guess what? That's it for our shave today. Once again, don't forget to get in the contest. 
just look for the 1500 subscriber giveaway um, video. Make sure you get in there, put the uh, put I'm in, and then the username from your TSC uh, membership. Uh, also, uh, Drinks and Dave's Tuesday night, 6 p.m., all about Vegas. And like, subscribe, and all that kind of good stuff. Well, guess what, folks? That's it. I'm Barbara Dave. This has been Barbara Dave Shaves and such. We'll see you again tomorrow. Take care.